Michael. Ladies and gentlemen, the first round of the six. Yeah. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, this. Oh, shit, bro. It's the fucking Dragon Off. Player from Team B hasn't played with the Dragon Off ever. Let's see if he can adapt to the situation. And yeah, a player in the red team is confused, but he, he clutches the win. Ladies and gentlemen, player from Team Blue forgot that the player from Team Red is a YouTuber. Let's see if this nerd can, uh, can conclude to a victory. Player from Team Red throwing in a nade. Player from Team Blue throwing it back one nade. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. And yes, he picks up the headshot. A stunning victory. It wasn't even a headshot. It was a shoulder shot. Now let's see with the PM with the PKM if uh, Jojo Papa can manage to sneak in a, a rapid shot. <laughs> Let's see now, ladies and gentlemen. He sort of sees him, but yes, he fails once again. And there he lays dead on the ground, ladies and gentlemen. A Chapra is coming in hot and heavy with the spray and pray. From the side position. Let's see now if uh, Jojo Papa, he, his screen turns off. Portable display is a piece of shit. Let's see now if he can adapt to this situation. And yes, this, the monitor is still on. We're back in play. And yeah, he falls again to the ground and face palms with fucking cockroach on the ground. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. What a piece of shit of a player. Jojo Papa is. I mean, yeah. And now the shotgun, ladies and gentlemen. Origin 12 shotgun. Primary weapon, secondary, a 1911 cult. Let's see. Picks up two hit markers. Let's see if he can get the shotgun kill. And yeah, he chokes. He fucking chokes and he throws a C4, but fails to detonate it. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, A Chapra is coming in hot and heavy. The monitor switches off again for some reason. And uh, here we go to a match point. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, if this. If. Axel can manage to sneak in a, a kill. He sees the nade. He runs out of bullets. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. Tosses in the flashbang. And it's a smoke. He thought it was a... Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, if he might clutch this. He's completely disoriented into the smoke. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, and he dies again. Now that was a fight. Solid work. The worst player in Call of Duty history dies in a perfect 0-6 uh, from Team Red. This was Allegiance Lost, Gunfight Speedball. Back to you. <laughs> Possibly the worst game in the history of games by uh, Jojo Papa 1. Let's see if in the next match he can actually manage to score a kill. Or even a hundred damage. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to round two of Speedball Gunfight. Featuring Jojo Papa and A. Japris. Starting off with the PKM. Let's see now if he can manage to sneak in a kill. This time, he's completely lost. He's a bit scared for his life. Seeing the... And yeah, he chokes to death once again on his own blood. Failing as he's stunned there. Choking a bunch of cacks. My god, is Jojo Papa really bad? Let's see now, ladies and gentlemen, round two. And he spots Chapras. Let's see if he can manage to sneak in uh, collateral damage. And no, he doesn't. Once again, Chapras is way too aggressive, way too good, way too dominant. And this 
type of uh, format. And uh, yeah, let's go on. We're moving ahead to the to the famous FR556. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, if he can sneak in at least a hundred score damage on the damage card. Sees him going on the left. Throws a flashbang. Throws a I don't know what that was. It was German grenade for Q. And he sneaks in a couple of hit markers, but no, ladies and gentlemen. He dies once again. You can see here the damage mark is almost the same, about 23 points off. But yet he doesn't manage to score a kill, ladies and gentlemen. Grabs in a headshot. Yes! Finally gets one victory. Through the through the wall there. Oh, and let's go. We're moving on to the three point three five seven Magnum. Let's see if he can match the score. A headshot, and he's he's Japras. And yeah, Japras is way too good once again. Jumps over the the whatever the fuck that is, and grabs a sneaky torso shot. To secure the kill. Equipment unavailable for three more seconds for two for one. And yes, Joshua Papa throws in a Molotov. Sees Japras. Tries to get him. And he in the torso shot. Or maybe it was a headshot? No, it wasn't even a shot on him. It was somewhere else. But it somehow magically it hit him. Let's see now what he's going to do with the X16. He spots Japras. He sees him. He runs through the choke, and yes, throws in a nade on the other side. Let's see if Joppa's gonna... He did! But Jojo Papa still failed to uh, follow up. He jumps in the air like a little dolphin. D-World. Reaching for fish, and now let's see if he's gonna manage to pick up a kill with the X-16 once again. Does this piece of shit gun go to full auto? Or no? And yeah, Japras is actually way too good once again. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, going in and yes! Japras picks up the victory once again, round two. Japras is way too good, or Jojo Papa is way too shit for this game. <laughs> How the fuck is that possible? <laughs> Yeah, and uh, kind of weird. I'm just gonna go ahead and put on 10 rounds, Japras. That's fine with you. Okay. Starting the matchup here, ladies and gentlemen, custom game between Jojo Papa 1 and A Japras. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. A Japras' coach told him that it would be a good idea to, to train with noobs and uh, he chose Jojo Papa 1 first uh, contestant and now with the AK-47 interesting selection from uh, the Odo uh, spots Japras even though he thought he spotted him he failed Spectacular headshot there by uh, Eight Japers. Once again, the AK-47 is quite a handy weapon when uh, when in dangerous hands. And let's see, Jojo Papa one drawing in the scoreboard. The spectacular collateral damage through the wall. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's move on to the Dragon Off. Let's see if. This piece of shit gun is going to do anything for uh, Jojo Papa. Now, once again, Jojo Papa is scared for his life. He doesn't know where Japras is. Japras, though, spots him. Throws in the nade. Let's see what the fuck's going to happen here. And yes, <laughs> as predicted. Spectacular fucking speed, scope, speed scoping by the master himself. 
Jabris, let's see if uh, anything can happen here. <laughs> They're both players, but not really. It's pretty much Jabris dominating the whole fucking game. Let's see, though, if he will show... Jojo Papa won some mercy. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. He doesn't even know where he is, and yeah. He got the kill once again. The monitor switch is off because of the piece of shit. Cheap fuck. Portable display, and here we go with the Model 680 pump action shotgun. Japra's rushing in. He sees him, and yes, he spots him, and fucking blasts him in the fucking anus. Now he's got a second asshole on his chest. Joshua Papa switching to the Deagle. If he can pick a long distance kill before Jaffras, the, the Reaper himself, the Boogeyman, comes close and destroys Jojo Papa 1. He doesn't even spot him. Yeah, he does. Let's see. Picks up a hit marker. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, if he can pick up a second kill. Yes, he does with the nade. Finally, uh, some strategical play by uh, Jojo Papa 1 instead of that rubbish he's been doing. And yes, he picks up the nade kill. <laughs> Moving on to round seven, ladies and gentlemen, let's see if this monster Japras can actually destroy Jojo Papa, and he fails once again, putting Jojo Papa one back in the game, sort of, in a four-three score. <laughs> Throws in a sneaky nade. Let's see now. If, yeah, dies again. With a spectacular A Jappers. Predicted the whole movement by Jojo Papa 1. Uh, what, what the fuck kind of name is Jojo Papa 1 anyway? Uh, uh, it's the weirdest name in the history of uh, usernames. And here comes Jojo Papa 1 with the stupidest name ever. Coming in hot and heavy with the MK. P PKM, sorry. Light machine gun. Let's see if he can rotate this back to the victory. And let's see, ladies and gentlemen. Jaffa scares like a little bird. Like a little kitten. And yes, he ties it up, ladies and gentlemen, to a 5 5. Free fires the shit out of that wall because he's scared of his life. For his life, I mean. Throws in the Magnum. Let's see if he can pick up a quick headshot. Predicted it and he actually turns the game around, ladies and gentlemen. The underdog, Jojo Papa 1, actually leads the score. And that's strange enough because he has actually less damage than Japra. But what the hell is going on in this game? See now. Japra's burning up on fire. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen. If he can actually manage to do this. And no, he doesn't. Jaffa's plays Next extremely round. well. Hides behind the pillar. The concrete pillar there. And jumps over it to secure the kill. Take that plot. AK-47 once again. Assault rifle from Russia. Let's see. And yes, he picks up the kill. Leads again 7-6. Jojo Papa 1. Still has less damage than Jaffa's. By a large margin. Still ten. I'm not getting a man. I'm not getting a man. I'm not getting a man. Oh, 
Ναι, 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 Ladies and gentlemen, coming in back in the game with a hot shot, sort of quick scope and action right there. Let's see what it'll do with the model 680 pump action shotgun. Locked him up with the flashbang and rotates on the other side of the container. Picks up the round win. Shoots him between the testicles. Match point, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if Jojo Papa can actually pick up a victory here. Finally, regain some of the honor he's lost throughout the games. And uh, let's see if Jojo Papa can actually land a nade shot. And he doesn't. Let's see if he can actually do something else with his life. And <laughs> Chapla's completely disoriented, ladies and gentlemen. Loses to the noob. The apprentice becomes the the master. <laughs> Comes in hot and heavy, winning round three.